Congressman Hal Rogers was in Eastern Kentucky today and he was briefed on what has going, been going on in his district since Sunday's storm led to devastating flooding. As Evening Edition's Michael Burke reports, Mr. Rogers is no stranger to loss. U.S. Congressman Hal Rogers came home today offering supplies and words of encouragement. Eastern Kentuckians love each other uh, and uh, realize that we're all creatures of God and we're here to help each other and that's what we're all trying to do. His constituents have arguably never needed help more than they do now. Rogers District was hammered by severe flooding Sunday night into Monday morning. Thousands lost everything and many don't have the resources to get any of it back. My daughter lost everything. She had her whole house. They had to tear the whole walls out. We lost the car, uh, damaged everything. We're here to help. Perhaps it's a good thing that Suzanne's congressman can relate to this kind of loss. Rogers once lost everything to a fire. I remembered how lonely and alone I felt with everything that I had accumulated over my life gone, burned up. Uh, and so I know the pain that people here are going through. So it wasn't necessarily just his job that brought him here this morning. Rogers said federal emergency support will soon follow and it will be much needed. I've lived down here in Jackson about 30 years and I never seen it this bad. Mr. Rogers said it's as bad as he was told. Then he reminded everyone in the region of what matters most now. There's more in life than to defeat the next county's basketball team. That is true, but Breathitt County and Lee County are scheduled to square off tonight. Maybe Congressman Rogers knew that. In Breathitt County, Michael Burke for Evening Edition.